What's up guys, Sammy from Knuckleball Twins. I have already tested the Mizuno Rabula Cut Boots. You guys are about to see the most insane knuckleball. I can't wait for you to see it, so look out for it in this video. So enjoy this one. There's a banner in there, maybe even more. Knuckle it. Back at the OG grass pitch today in the Malaga kit. I wish I was in Malaga, that was such an amazing time. <laughs> I'll be going back there though for sure. I've moved the goal as you can see. Today I'm going to be doing an updated review basically on the Mizuno Rabula Cut Boots. Possibly the most underrated football boot out there. Three years later since they first came out, I'm going to test them, see how they feel. I generally believe they are my go-to Mizuno boot from their range, including the Alpha and the Morelia Neo boots. You guys are going to see knuckleball free kicks in them. Let's get to it. If you want to know why we moved the goal, click this video right here. I'm shooting from here to start off with, so that's about 27 yards from the goal. Question of the video, which you guys can type out as you're about to see some free kicks. What is the best country you guys have ever visited? Let us know in the comments. Happy days, what a start. Two close, one scuff, and two goals. That speed sell off the bar, absolute banner. And it's so nice to have a GoPro replay view again. At the other pitch on the grass, we don't get that opportunity, unfortunately. So sick, I can't wait to watch it back. I've just had a look on my phone at our videos and the last time I wore the Mizuno Rabula Cut Boots was in this video with Kieran. It's crazy that it's been over a year since I last wore these boots. We're very lucky to receive a lot of new boots that get released, especially the Mizuno ones, but these Rabula Cut Boots for me are extremely underrated and not spoken about enough. I put these boots on and instantly they fill me with confidence. Last 45 minutes then, I'm going to shoot from the right side. I'm very limited for space. The last time I did knuckleball free kicks from the right side was in our New York video that we uploaded just towards the end of last year. Check that out after this. Oh. 
rotation of footballs all the way over there is not ideal when you're on a time limit. <laughs> so I'm just going to move back to the left. The wind's been turned on, but nothing is going to get rid of this. So buzzed. Ending the session on a massive high. So gutted though, there's no GoPro replay, but I'm over it. It's all good. <laughs> right in the upper 90. The amount of free kicks I've done like that, that will hit the post and come out, or hit the bar and go over, or go across the goal and not in the net. It goes right in the upper 90, and then lands in the net. That is unbelievable. That's why I keep going. That's why I'm out here. That's why I edit every day, constantly thinking of new ideas. Also trying to adapt and use your ideas that you let us know about in the comments. Oh mate, absolutely delighted. I'm ending the session there. No durability damage. Thank you for watching. Please like this video guys, because a lot of work goes into these as we stress to you quite often. <laughs> if you want to see more tutorial videos on how to do the technique, check out the description. Those tutorial videos need a few more likes. If you want to see more, that includes our latest secret tips video and our latest tutorial that was uploaded last year. Go back and like those videos if you haven't already. Quick bonus clip if you're still here. Always remember that it's not just about the boots, it's about the player. Learn the skills you want to learn to improve your techniques. Use our tutorials and it will help you as well as the boots you get. But I highly recommend the Mizuno Rabula Cup boots if you can get hold of them.